Now new details in a high profile murder on Christmas Eve. This morning we're learning more about what happened that night. Carolee Taylor lost her life. Channel 2's Taisha Walker joins us now live with that story. Taisha. Yeah, court records shedding a light on some of those details that happened at a West Harris County home on Christmas Eve. Witnesses even telling investigators that the suspect allegedly hinted about death that day. Now, we know that um, the shooting happened on Christmas Eve at a West Harris County home. We also know that according to court records that the suspect uh, was mad at his ex-girlfriend, Carol Taylor, and decided to to allegedly raid a Christmas party for her, which was Christmas Eve party, which was actually on her birthday. Uh, he allegedly walked up to the uh, sus the witnesses, excuse me, he walked up to the victim's uncle and uh, threatened him with two handguns, made his way inside of the party, asked Carol Taylor to come outside of the party, and that's when he allegedly shot her five times. Uh, according to a confession that he made to to a friend after the shooting. He shot her once in the head and then four times after because he felt that she betrayed him. Uh, he then got into a uh, shootout yesterday with uh, Harris County deputies. They found him after multiple leads at Herman Park here in the Houston area. And uh, they say that he tried to reach toward an item in his bag and allegedly told them to shoot him, shoot him. And that is when uh, they, the, a deputy Deputy began to shoot the suspect and he did die at a hospital. That's the latest information that we have this morning. Uh, we do know that the Houston Police Department, which is why we're out here, is investigating the shooting involving that Harris County deputy and the suspected killer. Reporting live from downtown, Taisha Walker, KPRC Channel 2 News.